You are welcome into the presence of the Most High God. You are welcome into the presence of the Creator of the Head. You are welcome into the presence of the Almighty God. I want you to lift up your voice and appreciate God for giving you an eye the grace to be alive. Appreciate Him for the love that He has showered us with by sending His only begotten Son Jesus Christ to come into the world and die for our sins. Father, we appreciate you. The almighty, everlasting, merciful, glorious, beautiful, excellent God, we bow before your throne to say, Hallowed be thy name. Lord, I set our thanks, we pray thee in the name of Jesus. Father, we are grateful for the gift of life. We are grateful for sending your only begotten Son, Jesus Christ, to die for us on the cross of Calvary. We are grateful for giving us authority and power in the name of Jesus. Thank you, Lord, for making us, O oh God, sons and daughters of your kingdom. Thank you, Jehovah God, for connecting us to the circuit of prayer, power, and holy goals. Thank you, Jehovah Lord, for giving us victory over principalities, over powers, over wickedness in high places, over territorial forces. Thank you, Lord, for shining your light upon us. Thank you, Lord, for giving us victory over the arrows of darkness. Lord, thank you, Jehovah God, for giving us victory over the pestilence that walketh in darkness and the destruction that wastes a new day. Thank you, Lord, for rescuing us, O God, from the pit of hell. Father, in all situations, O God, and over every family, every life, say this hour, we say take all the glory now and forevermore in the name of Jesus. Take all the glory now and forevermore in the name of Jesus. We thank you, Lord, for not allowing the enemies to prevail over us. We thank you, Lord, for not allowing the wicked hands to pull us down. Thank you, Lord, for destroying the evil legs trampling upon us. Thank you, Lord, for destroying the thongs of the wicked rising up against us and raising against our progress. Thank you, Jehovah God, for the salvation of our souls. I set our thanks now and forevermore in the name of Jesus. Merciful and everlasting Father, we know we have sinned against the uncomfortable of your glory. That it tonight will return back to your throne. We bow before your throne and we cry to you, Almighty, for forgiveness of our sins. Against the own, you only have we done this evil in your sight. Father, every evil that you have done in your sight, evil of unforgiveness, evil of iniquity of the heart, evil of every kind of sins, O oh God. Lord, we pray for forgiveness. Forgive us of all our sins, O God. Forgive us of all our sins. Every sins, O God, in us that has opened the door of destructions into our lives. Father, forgive us in the name of Jesus. Any sin, O God, that has shut the doors of our prayers. Father, we pray for forgiveness, O Lord. Forgive us in the name of Jesus. Sins that has captured our souls. Sins that has captured our flesh. Sins that has captured our body. So that spirit, Father, forgive us. We pray thee in the name of Jesus. Give us victory, Lord, over besetting sins. Give us victory, O Lord, over besetting sins and set us free from the bondage and captivities of sin in the name of Jesus. Tonight, O Lord, we pray thee for the baptism of the Holy Spirit. Father, Lord, baptize us, O Lord, we pray thee for the anointing of the Holy Ghost in the name of Jesus. Baptize this church, the path of righteousness, the church of God. Let this church be baptized afresh with the anointing of the Holy Ghost in the name of Jesus. Every member in this church, baptize us, O Lord, with the anointing of the Holy Ghost. Baptize this church, baptize this church, baptize our lives, baptize our marriages, baptize our children, baptize every family here this hour with the anointing of the Holy Ghost in the name of Jesus. Give us super wisdom, knowledge, and understanding, O God, to live a righteous and a fulfilled life in the name of Jesus. Give us, O God, the power to trample upon serpents, upon scorpions, and over all the manipulation and advancement of the devil in the name of Jesus. That in my life I lay at your feet, O God, that they connect me, O God, forever 
to the socket of prayer power and Holy Ghost and wake me up, O Lord, from spiritual slumber. Give me the grace to pray without ceasing. Give me the authority to pray without ceasing. Open the eyes of my understanding. Open my spiritual eyes, O God, and lay your mighty hand upon me. Break me, then, O Lord, remove me and make me, O Lord, a vessel unto honor, fit for your use all the days of my life. And let your gospel, O God, let your word. Let your messages, O God, be released on from this church to the four walls of this head. And let your gospel go forth right now and win souls for your kingdom. Let your gospel go forth and be the light unto the feet of men and the lamp unto their path. In the name of Jesus, let your gospel go forth, O God, as the word of God that will set the captives free. Let your gospel go forth as the unchangeable word of God, as the powerful word of God. And break loose those in bondage and captivities of the wicked in the mighty name of Jesus. We soak this service, we soak this church, the path of rest of the church of God into the pool of the blood of Jesus and in the fire of the Holy Ghost. We commit this 21 day deliverance program from the activities of our place, spirit to joy to God. Let there be move of your power and let every life, oh God, under the influence and the torture of this of the spirit, let them all receive their deliverance, their breakthrough, and and they are setting free in the mighty name of our Lord Jesus Christ. We cover every life, we cover this church with the blood of Jesus and with the fire of the Holy Ghost. Thank you, glorious God. Thank you, beautiful King. Thank you, excellent Father. In Jesus' most beautiful, wonderful, and excellent name, we have prayed. Amen, amen, amen in Jesus' name. For this glorious service, the Lord has given us the grace to sing Christian seek not yet repose. Hear yeah, that guy that angel say, Thou art in the midst of us. Watch and pray. What the aim is telling us is reminding us and waking us, giving us a wake up call as believers that we should seek notice to post. Hear yeah, what the guardian angels say. That means we all have guardian angels reminding us that we are in the midst of hosts. We are in the midst of battles. We are in the midst of the enemies. Beloved, never trust anyone. Never put your trust in man because man can be used by the unclean spirit to destroy life. As we sing this in. May God Almighty wake us up, wake up the church, wake up the ministers, wake up the pastors from spiritual slumber in the name of Jesus. May He open the eyes of every life here tonight and may He give us the grace to pray always without ceasing in the mighty name of our Lord Jesus Christ. Praise ye the living God. Hallelujah. Praise then, seek not yet repose. Hear the guardian angel say, Thou art in the midst of us. Watch uh, and pray. Prince, it is a past. Most in their own sin array. Watch for thy own guided us. Watch uh, and pray. Mm -hmm. Guide the heavenly armor on, where it ever night and day ambush lies the evil one. Watch uh, and pray. Mm -hmm. yeah. The victors overcome, see the man it warriors with, or with one sweet voice exclaim, watch and pray. Air <laughs> above all air the Lord, if thou lovest to obey, I read in the heart is what, what I am praying. What has he on doubt alone on the issue of the day? Pray that help me be sent down. What I am praying. Amen. 
the Lord God Almighty, the Creator of heaven and earth, may He give us the grace to watch and pray. May He give us the grace to be spiritually alert. May He give us the grace and the power to guide and to direct us and to walk in the path of the Almighty. In the name of Jesus, lift up your oil before God and pray like this. Say, Almighty God, I am in your presence. Touch this oil and make it the oil of power. Almighty God, we present the oil before thee. Lord, this is ordinary oil. We pray thee, O Lord, touch this oil and make it the oil of power. Anointed oil, oil of healing, oil of fire. Oil of authority of God. Let this oil carry the uncommon anointing of the Holy Ghost. Let this oil be the oil that will lift up our heads far, far above our enemies. Let this oil, O God, receive the fire of God in the name of Jesus. Whenever we use this oil, let infirmities disappear. Let evil laws disappear. Let every mark of the enemies disappear. Let every joke of darkness be broken to pieces in the mighty name of Jesus. Father, I will thank you because you have done it. In Jesus' name, we pray. I want you to lift up your voice and pray. The him that will sing, say, watch and pray. Thou art in the midst of us. Watch and pray. We are starting to pray now. Serious prayers for our children prayers for the families prayers for ourselves i want you to lift up your voice and pray for your children like this say fire of god almighty punch my children from demonic and witchcraft deposit in the mighty name of jesus fire of god almighty oh god almighty with your fire we pray thee for the lives of our children from the demonic and witchcraft deposit purge the lives of our children purge the lives of our children from witchcraft and demonic deposit in the name of jesus purge the lives of our children oh lord almighty god almighty god purge our children oh god purge their lives from their heads to the sole of their feet from every demonic and witchcraft deposit in jesus name we are praising wicked arrows fire against the lives of our children wrong of ages collide with the arrows and let the arrows backfire in the name of jesus evil arrows fire against the lives of our children Rock of it is your mighty God. Go lie with such evil arrows. Let the evil arrows backfire. Let the evil arrows backfire. Let the arrows of death, arrows of failure, arrows of sicknesses, arrows of infirmities, arrows of madness, arrows of poverty, every wicked arrows, fire to destroy the lives of our children, fire to destroy their future, fire to destroy their jobs, fire to destroy their marriages. Oh, God Almighty. The man of war, rock of ages, could lie with such evil arrows. Let the evil arrows backfire. Let the evil arrows backfire. In Jesus' name, we are praising wicked altars. Call in the names of our children. Any man or woman setting up evil altars and invoking evil spirits from the altars against the lives of our children die with your altars die with your altars die with your altars die with your altars in the name of jesus die with your altars die with your altars die with your altars in jesus name we have prayed say causes spells jokes incantations enchantment divinations issued against our children catch fire in the name of jesus i say catch fire causes spells incantations divinations jokes of darkness injured against the lives of our children almighty god set them on fire set them on fire set them on fire set them on fire set them on fire, them on fire. Them on fire. in jesus name we are praising evil hands 
pressing down the heads of our children. We are now in the name of Jesus. We are. We are, we are by the fire of the Holy Ghost. I command you to we are. Rika, 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 Rima, Rika, Derebo. I command you to we are. Every wicked hands pressing down the heads of our children. We are, we are, we are. In Jesus' name, we are praising any power anywhere. Saying our children will not be lifted up. And you, God, die in the name of Jesus. Any power anywhere. Saying our children will not be lifted up. Saying their heads will not be celebrated. And you, God, die in the name of Jesus. 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 In Jesus' name, we are praising witchcraft manipulations against our children expire and catch fire we pray the O law let witchcraft manipulations against us of our children expire and catch fire expire and catch fire expire and catch fire in jesus name it is said to oh god almighty we pray thee let oppression die in the lives of our children let oppression die physical oppression spiritual oppression fear anxiety worries die in the lives of our children die in the lives of our children in jesus name we are praying say almighty god Give our children sound mind, wisdom, knowledge, and understanding in the name of Jesus. Almighty God, we pray thee. Give our children sound mind, wisdom, knowledge, understanding in the name of Jesus. Almighty God, we pray thee. Give our children sound mind, wisdom, knowledge, and understanding in Jesus' name. We have prayed. Say, save the souls of our children. Almighty God, we pray thee. And keep them under your shadow all the days of their lives. Almighty God, we pray thee. Keep our children, O God. Save the souls of our children. Save our children, O God. Save our children, O God. Anywhere our children may be, O Lord. Father, save them. Save them, O Lord, and keep them under your shadow all the days of their lives. Keep them, O Lord, under your shadow all the days of their lives. Keep them, O Lord, under your shadow all the days of their lives. In Jesus' name, we have prayed. In Jesus' name, we have prayed. Say, you, my children, Hear the voice of the Lord. The Lord will make you to be for signs and wonders all the days of your lives. In the name of Jesus, our children hear the voice of the Almighty God. Lord, we pray thee, make our children for signs and wonders all the days of their lives. Make our children to be for signs and wonders all the days of their lives. Make our children, O oh Lord, to be for signs and wonders all the days of their lives. In Jesus' name, we have prayed. We are going to pray for ourselves. Say, sicknesses unto death. My life reject you now in the name of Jesus. Sicknesses in and infirmities unto death will reject you now. We reject you now. We reject you now. We reject you now. In the mighty name of Jesus, sicknesses and infirmities unto death will reject you. Oh Lord God Almighty, remove sicknesses and infirmities that are unto death. Remove them from our lives. Remove them from our lives. In Jesus' name, we are praying. Say, uncontrollable bitter tears. Oh God Almighty. Cause the root of the tears to dry up in the name of Jesus. Almighty God, we pray thee, dry up the root of bitter tears in our lives. Let bitter tears dry up in our lives. Almighty God, we pray thee, dry up bitter tears in our lives. Dry up bitter tears in our lives. In Jesus' mighty name, we are praising powers, networking with other powers to be oppressing and torturing us. Oh God Almighty, we pray thee, destroy them, O Lord, in the name of Jesus. Destroy them, O Lord, in the name of Jesus. Wicked powers networking to destroy us, networking to torture and to torment us with other powers. Almighty God, we pray thee, O Lord, destroy them, O Lord, destroy them, O Lord, destroy them, O Lord, destroy them. In Jesus' name, we are praying, wicked powers setting limits for our progress wicked powers swallowing up the works of our hands are you god tonight is your hand die in the name of jesus die in the name of Jesus. wicked powers setting limits for our progress wicked powers swallowing up our riches are you god tonight is your hand die in the name of jesus die in the name of jesus in jesus name we are present witchcraft presence around me which 
witchcraft presence in my life, witchcraft presence around my home. Fire of God, destroy them now in the name of Jesus. Witchcraft presence around us, witchcraft presence within us, witchcraft presence against us. Almighty God, we pray thee, destroy them, O Lord, destroy them, O Lord, destroy them, O Lord, destroy them, O Lord, destroy them, O Lord. In Jesus' name, we are praying. Say, the word of God shall not expire in my life and in my mouth. Word of God shall not expire in in our lives and in our mouth in the name of jesus word of god shall not expire in our lives and our mouth but shall become fire in us word of god shall not expire in our lives and in our mouth but shall become fire in us word of god become fire in our lives in our mouth in our destinies in our hopes let the word of god become fire in jesus name we are praising oh god almighty in the enemies are leading me astray by your righteous right hand lead me back to the path of righteousness in the name of jesus almighty god if the enemies are leading us astray by your mighty and power lead us back to the path of righteousness lead us back all to the path of righteousness in the name of jesus if the enemies are, are leading us astray almighty god we pray thee by your righteous right hand, lead us, O oh God, to the path of righteousness. In Jesus' name, we have prayed. We are going to pray for our homes. See, every root of confusion and fighting in my home, that in the name of Jesus, O oh God Almighty, we pray thee, let the root of confusion and fight in every homes. Let those evil die. Die in the name of Jesus. Root of confusion and fighting in homes. Die now, we pray thee. Let them die. Oh God Almighty, destroy the root of confusion in our homes. Destroy the root of confusion and fighting in our homes. In Jesus' name, we are praising wicked powers, impoverishing our homes. So must sought and die in the name of Jesus. Father, we pray thee, O Lord, let the wicked powers that are impoverishing our homes, let them die by your power oh lord god we pray to you lord we ask before thee that let the wickedness of the wicked impoverish in our homes let them die let them die let them die in jesus name we have prayed say riches in my home that, that the wickedness have swallowed riches belonging to our homes that has been swallowed by wickedness be vomited back be vomited back be vomited back be vomited back to us in the name of jesus with riches in our homes that has been swallowed by all repentant household wickedness by witches and wizards by wicked powers, be vomited back to us, be vomited back to us, be vomited back to us. In Jesus' name, we are praying. Pray this with holy anger. Say, Almighty God, I pray thee, build your edge of fire around my home. Almighty God, we pray thee. We ask, O oh God Almighty, that you build your edge of fire around us and around our homes. Build your edge of fire around us and our homes. Build your edge of fire around us and around our homes. In Jesus' name we have prayed say you my hope hear the voice of the lord you shall be the house of god in the name of jesus our home shall be the house of god our home shall be the house of god shall be the tabernacle of jesus jesus christ come down we pray thee be the head of our homes jesus christ almighty god we pray thee be the head of our homes be the head of our homes be the head of our homes in jesus mighty name it is done. We are going to pray for the church, the path of righteousness church of God. The Bible says, I will build my church. It is God that will build his church, that the gate of hell will not be able to prevail. If a man is building, the gate of hell can prevail. If friends are building, the gate of hell can prevail. If nation is building, gate of hell can prevail. It is only the building of God that the gate of hell cannot prevail. Say, the path of righteousness church of God receive the baptism of the holy ghost and fire in the name of jesus the path of righteousness church of god receive fresh baptism of the holy ghost and fire 
be baptized by God. Lord, we pray thee, baptize this church with Holy Ghost and with fire, with the anointing of the Holy Ghost and with fire. Baptize this church, O oh Lord. Baptize this church, O oh Lord, with the anointing of the Holy Ghost and with fire. In Jesus' name, we have prayed. Say, anointing for signs and wonders. Father, release upon this church anointing of ease, anointing of signs and wonders, anointing to set the captives free, anointing to win souls, anointing to heal the sick, anointing for super miracles. Fall upon this church, O oh Lord, we pray thee. Release upon this church. Release upon this church, we pray thee. In the name of Jesus, anointing of the Holy Ghost, anointing for signs and wonders, anointing for miracles, anointing to heal the sick, anointing to raise the dead, anointing of the Almighty God. Father, pour upon the path of righteousness, Church of God. Pour upon your church, pour upon your church, pour upon your church. Whenever we get that in this church to pray, let them walk. Father, Lord, make the lame to walk, make the blind to see, make the dead to rise, make impossibilities of God possible. In the name of Jesus, whenever we gather here to pray, oh Lord, Father, we pray, oh Lord, over answer our prayers. Answer us, oh God. Answer us, we pray, oh God. Answer us, we pray, oh God. In Jesus' name, we have prayed. The power of rest the church of God go from glory to glory from power to power and begins to win souls for the kingdom of God father let this church father lord take this church from your take this church in your glory take this church oh god spread this church yourself to the four walls of this earth and let this church oh god be the instrument of God to win souls be your instrument to win souls for your kingdom father use this church oh lord we pray thee to win souls to bring back the lost souls to win fresh souls for your kingdom in the name of Jesus. Father, we pray thee, use this church, O oh Lord, as your instrument. Use this church, O oh Lord, as a medium. Use this church, O oh Lord, as your tools, O oh God, to win souls for your kingdom, to depopulate the kingdom of darkness, to raise the dead, to heal the sick, to open the eyes of the blind, and to draw men unto yourself. In Jesus' name, we are praising Almighty God. Let your church carry fire. Let your church carry fire. Let all the members carry fire. Carry fire of Holy Ghost. Let your church carry fire of Holy Ghost. Let all the members carry fire of Holy Ghost. In Jesus' name, we are praying. Father, we pray thee that let any power anywhere standing as a barrier or setting limits for this church father in your own way as your mighty god disappoint them right now in the name of jesus go we pray thee go before your church make all the crooked places before your church straight break in pieces the gate of brass and the bars mighty name of Jesus, in the mighty name of Jesus, in the mighty name of Jesus, let the name of your church, O oh God, go for as long as the sun and the moon will remain. Let the name of your church remain and abide under your shadow all the days of our lives that are worshippers here in the name of Jesus. Let the name of your church, O oh God, be forever in the name of Jesus. Any power, anyway, Lord, we pray thee, whosoever is praying against your church, whosoever is praying against this church, Father, in the name of our Lord Jesus Christ, disappoint them, O Lord. Disappoint them, O Lord. We pray thee, O Lord, disappoint the enemies of this church in the name of Jesus. To you be the glory. In Jesus' mighty name, we are praying. We are going to pray for this nation. We are going to pray like this. Say, you, this nation, hear the voice of the Lord. You, this nation, hear the voice of the Lord. Be flowing from now with meek and honey. In the name of Jesus, O oh Lord God, we ask, O oh God, that Lord, let this nation, O oh God, be flowing with your meek and your honey. Bring meek and honey to this nation. Bring meek and honey to this land. Bring milk and honey to this land. Lord, we pray to you, Lord. Bring joy. Bring peace. Bring testimonies. Bring milk and honey to this land. In Jesus' name, we are praying. Father, we pray thee. Let the enemies of the peace of this land, let them be removed and be bound forever. Father, Lord, let the enemies of the peace of this land be removed and be bound forever. Be removed and be bound forever. Be removed and be bound forever. In Jesus' In Jesus' name, we are praying. Say, enemies, Father, we pray thee, let all those robbing the wealth of this land, 
let them be caught and let them let there be divine restoration of all the stolen wealth of this land in the name of jesus father let all the stolen wealth of this land be restored back father restore back oh lord wherever the stolen wealth of this land may be, have been kept father lord we pray thee oh lord restore back restore the lost and stolen weight of this nation back restore the lost and the stolen weight of this nation back in jesus mighty name it is settled wonderful father we thank you blessed savior glorious father beautiful king take all the glory tonight and forevermore in the name of jesus we cover this church with the blood of jesus we cover all the members we cover every life here in the pool of the blood of jesus and in the fire of the holy ghost thank you blessed father Thank you, mighty Savior, in Jesus' most beautiful, powerful, and excellent name, we have prayed. Amen, 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 in Jesus' name. Tonight, and to the glory of our Lord Jesus Christ, you are all welcome to day 12 of our 21 days deliverance program from the activities of unclean spirit. And my prayer to God is any power anywhere bringing evil into our lives may god in heaven as we cry to god and as we appear in his presence may god end their rage and their presence in our lives in the name of our lord jesus christ may our tormentors those who had vowed to rage against us those who had vowed to pull us down father we pray thee disappoint them O lord in the name of jesus the bible says unto thee O lord do i lift up my soul Oh my God, with I trust in thee. Let me not be ashamed. Let not my enemies triumph me. Father Lord, upon your word we pray thee, O oh Lord. Let us not be ashamed. Do not let the enemies to triumph over us in the name of Jesus. In our work, in our businesses, in our ministry, though we pray thee. No matter how many the enemies may be, no matter how strong they may be, do not let them transfer us. But I give us victory over all their plans. Give us victory over the battles of darkness in the name of Jesus. They serve to the glory of God. We are looking at what the Lord has given us the grace to look into, which is poverty and rags. Poverty and rags. When the riches, when the wealth, when the labor of a life, when they are also swallowed what is left will be poverty and rags i want you to pray any power feeding on my wealth any power feeding on our riches any power feeding on the on the labor of our hands from tonight oh lord god almighty destroy them open your mouth and pray say oh lord we pray thee let all the powers feeding on our wealth on our riches on, on the labor of our hands, let such powers, O God, Father, destroy them, O Lord. Destroy such powers, any power, O Lord, that has turned our wealth, that has turned our riches, that has turned the labor of our hands to be their meal. Almighty God, we pray the O Lord, destroy them before us, destroy them before us, destroy them before us, destroy them before us, destroy them before us. In Jesus' name, we are praising all our lost and stolen, all our lost lost stolen and swallowed riches and blessings being vomited back by the being vomited back by the power of god almighty almighty god we pray thee let all our stolen wealth let all our stolen riches let all our swallowed blessings let them all be vomited back to us 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 in jesus name we have prayed praise the lord in ephesians chapter 6 verse 12 Ephesians chapter 6, verse 12. Day 12, we are looking at what the Lord has given us the grace, which is poverty and rags. And in Ephesians chapter 6, verse 12, the Bible says, For we wrestle not against flesh and blood, but against principalities, against powers, against rulers of the darkness of this world, against spiritual wickedness in high places. For we wrestle not against flesh and blood, but against what? Against principalities against powers against rulers of the darkness of this world against spiritual wickedness in high places and in job chapter 20 verse 15 job chapter 20 verse 15 the bible says he has swallowed down riches and he shall vomit them up again god shall cast them out of his belly he has swallowed down riches there is a power that can swallow down riches there are authorities that can swallow down riches. There are wickedness that can swallow down riches. 
But the Bible is giving us the assurance tonight that even though he has swallowed down the riches, I don't know how that entity managed to swallow down riches, but God is telling you and I tonight that he shall vomit them up again. Father, in the name of our Lord Jesus, we pray the whole Lord to you. Let all our swallow down riches be vomited back to us in the name of Jesus. And God shall cast them out of his belly. Father, cast out of the belly of the wicked. Cast out from the belly of serpent and scorpions. Cast out of the bellies of the dark ovens. All our swallowed blessings, all our swallowed wealth, all our swallowed riches in the name of our Lord Jesus Christ. Thank you, Father. In Jesus' name, we have prayed. There are so many things that can swallow down the riches of a man. And when those riches are swallowed, what is led is always poverty and rags. When the wealth of a man is swallowed, what is what will be left will be poverty and rags. When the works of a man, the works of the hands of a man, when those things are swallowed, what is left for the man will be poverty and rags. There are so many things in life that the unclean spirit can use to swallow up someone's wealth. There are so many things things in life that the unclean spirit can use to bury someone's riches. The unclean spirit, based on that name, unclean, their mission is to make a beauty of a man to become ashes. Their mission is to, to turn the beauty of a life to ashes. Their mission is to turn the riches of a life to poverty. Their agenda is to make a man's garment of glory to become the garment of rags. And I pray in the name of Jesus that Lord, we pray unto thee that any power that wants us to wear rags, any power that wants our children to wear rags, any power planning to impoverish our lives, Lord, we pray thee, waste them with your fire. Father, destroy those powers. Destroy those powers in the name of Jesus. Destroy those powers in Jesus' name. We have prayed. Amen. In Mark chapter 5, let's look at the Bible and see the example in the Bible of someone that this unclean spirit made to spend all without a clue. In Mark chapter 5, let's read from verse 25 to 34. Let's open our Bible together. It is in the Bible that you, you and I will get strength. It is in the Bible that we get faith. It is in the Bible that we get power and understanding. Let's open our Bible together. Mark chapter 5, and I read from verse 25 to 34. The Bible says, And a certain woman, which had an issue of blood 12 years, she had an issue of blood 12 years. The issue of blood for 12 years, no matter what, no matter how much money she had, that issue of blood we drain the wealth. Let's continue. And she has suffered many things of many physicians and has spent all that she had. That means she had money. She had substance. She had wealth. But the issue of blood, her problems, that big problem made her to spend all. And she had spent all that she had and was nothing better, but rather grew worse. So that means that spirit, that unclean spirit, causing the issue of law was bent on wrecking the finance of this woman, was bent on making this woman never to have anything called riches. When she had heard of Jesus, came in the press behind and touched his garment. For she said, if I may touch but his clothes, I shall be whole. And straight away way the fountain of her blood was dried up and she felt in her body that she was ill of that plague and jesus immediately knowing in himself that virtue had gone out of him turned him about in the press and said who touched my clothes and his disciples said unto him thou seest the multitude thronging thee and said thou who touched me and he looked round about to see her that had done this. But the woman, fearing and trembling, knowing what was done in her, came and fell before him and told him all the truth. And he said unto her, Daughter, thy faith 
had made the oath. Jesus called our daughter. Jesus changed her identity. Initially, she was addressed as a certain woman with her issue of blood. But after the encounter with Jesus, Jesus turned her identity to the identity of a daughter. Daughter, thy faith hath made thee whole. Go in peace and be whole of thy play. Jesus called her daughter and Jesus set her free. Jesus stopped that demonic forces. Jesus stopped that evil flow. Jesus stopped that unclean spirit. Jesus stopped the demons. Jesus stopped the evil spirit that were tormenting her and draining her world. Tonight, any power anywhere, any spirit anywhere, draining our resources, draining our wealth, draining our labor in order to impoverish us. Oh God, we pray thee, as you stop the issue of blood in the life of this woman, the Lord, let such powers, oh God, be stopped in our lives in the name of Jesus. The unclean spirit can sponsor poverty and rats in a life by making that life to be spending on things that will end the flow of their riches. This woman was spending on the issue of blood. The unclean spirit, they sponsor the flow of blood to this woman. I don't know the flow of blood in your life that the enemies are using to take away your wealth. I don't know the flow of blood in your life that the enemies are using to sponsor poverty and rags. I don't know the flow of blood in your life that the enemies are using to make you and I to become poor. All I know tonight is this. As the woman encountered Christ and the issue of blood ceased, every channel, every plan, every way, every devices that the enemies are using to sponsor poverty and rats into our lives, as we pray to God tonight, Father, let those channels, let those ways, oh God, be destroyed now in the name of Jesus. We pray to the Father, destroy those ways, destroy those channels, destroy those devices, destroy those plans in the name of Jesus. The, end, the issue of blood in this age can be spending on demonic habits like drinking, smoking, or visiting the alert. The issue of blood in a life that the enemies can use to sponsor poverty and rags can be spending on incurable diseases and sicknesses. It can be the enemies will bring liars into a life that will be lying to that life and be taking money from that life. The issue of blood in the life can be being surrounded by wasters, being surrounded by emptiers, being surrounded by destroyers. How can we overcome these demon or demons that are sponsoring poverty and rags? Beloved, the woman with this your blood did one thing. She found a way to Christ. Jesus is the true solution for all problems. Jesus is the only solution. Jesus is the only way. Jesus is the only almighty. Jesus is the only power that can stop the rage and the activities of unclean spirit. The unclean spirit will keep bringing out the issue of blood, not until when man when not until when we go to Christ, it is only Christ that can stop the issue of blood. The issue of blood in the life of that woman was impoverishing the woman, but Christ stopped the flow. Christ healed the woman. Are you here tonight? Have you given your life to Christ? Or were you once in Christ and now you are no longer in Christ? Find your way back to Christ so that the issue of blood in your life, so that the issue of blood in your lineage, the issue of blood in your home can be stopped. Jesus is the way, is the truth and the life. Invite Jesus into your life. Make him your Lord and personal Savior. Call upon him, surrender your life to him. He's your creator, he's your maker, he's your everything. Say, Lord Jesus, I am in your presence tonight. Lord, I pray thee, forgive us of all our sins. Wash us clean, we pray thee, from all iniquities that have separated you from us. Create in us, O God, a new heart, and lay your mighty hand upon us. Write our names, O God, we pray thee, in the book of life. And Lord, change our identities, O God, to become sons and daughters 
of your kingdom. Thank you, wonderful Father. In Jesus' name, we are praying. Now pray this singular prayer. Say, ancient evil flow. Hmm. Ancient evil flow. Ancient issues of blood in my lineage. Ancient evil flow. Ancient issues of blood in my lineage. Sponsor to bring poverty and rags into my life. Ancient evil flow. Ancient issues of blood in our lineage. Sponsor to bring poverty and life and wrath into our lives. Hear the voice of the Lord, Almighty God. Destroy them now. Destroy them now. Destroy them now. Oh Lord, we pray thee. Destroy, oh Lord God Almighty. Ancient evil flow. Ancient issues of blood in our life. Sponsoring poverty and rags. Almighty God, destroy them now. Destroy them now. Destroy them now. Destroy them now. In Jesus' name, we are praying. Add this one to it. Issue of blood in my life cease now in the name of Jesus. Say, as I'm praying to God, Father, let the issues of blood in our lives cease in the name of Jesus. As we are praying, oh God, to you, let the issue of issues of blood sponsoring poverty and rats in our life cease. Oh Lord, we pray thee, let the issue of blood cease. Let the issue of blood cease. In Jesus' name, we are praying. Say, Father, had this one to you, beloved. Say, Father, change my identity to be to be your son. In the name of Jesus, change our identity, so God, to be your sons and daughters. Change our identity, so God, to be your sons and daughters. Change our identity, so God, to be your sons and daughters. In Jesus' name, we are praying. Lastly, pray this one. Say, oh, oh Lord God, my Father, restore me back of all my wasted years. Restore me back. Restore us back of all our wasted years. In the name of the Almighty God, restore us back of all our wasted years. Restore us back, oh Lord, of our wasted years, of our riches, of our blessings, of our testimonies, every good thing that we have wasted, every opportunity that the enemy has stolen from us. Oh Lord, restore us back. 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 In Jesus' name, we are praising my life, my home, this church, Reject the demon and the spirit of poverty and rags. Our lives, our hope, Lord, we pray thee. Let the rags and poverty be rejected. Lord, oh, Father, reject poverty for us. Reject rags for us. Reject poverty for us. Reject rags for us. In Jesus' name, we are praying from this day on. The Lord will change my garment. Father, change our garments, O God. Give us the garment of riches. Give us the garment of honor. Father, change our garments, O God. Change our garment, O God. Give us the garment of riches, garment of honor, garment of glory. In Jesus' name, it is settled. Father, we thank you because you are God. Thank you, Lord, for setting us free from this demon of poverty and rags. Thank you, Lord, for changing our identities. Thank you, Lord, for setting us free from those powers swallowed up riches. Thank you, Lord, for making us to be a partaker of this glorious and wonderful time in your presence. Lord, take all the glory now and forevermore in the name of Jesus. That we pray that any power planning to take us away from your presence, let us power fail in the name of Jesus. In our sleep tonight, Daddy Lord, we pray for divine revelation. We pray for cleansing. We pray for open eyes. Father, Lord, divine revelation give unto us, O God. Cleanse us, O God, and give us, O God, every desire of our hearts. Make us to see beyond the ordinary in the mighty name of Jesus. To you be the glory. To you be the honor. We cover ourselves, we cover our families with the blood of Jesus and with the fire of the Holy Ghost. In Jesus' most beautiful, wonderful, and excellent name, we have prayed. Amen. 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 In Jesus' name. If the message is a blessing to share the good news, tell the world that God is the Almighty that can stop the issue of blood that the demons of this world are using to impoverish lives. As you share this goodness, may God Almighty use you as vessel and as oracle 
to win souls for his kingdom. And on the last day, may you and I, our families, our children, our husbands, and our unborn generations, may we all be with Christ in paradise. Remember, Jesus is Lord. is coming back shortly. We should all endeavor to be living righteous, holy, the life of faith and obedience to God and to his word. And in the name of our Lord Jesus Christ, may God Almighty keep us standing to the end. In the name of our Lord Jesus. We meet every day, 5 p.m. Irish time till our 5 on Facebook and YouTube. Tomorrow is another time. Let's come together to seek the face of the Lord and to pray. My prayer to God is for God Almighty to over answer our prayers. God bless you and keep shining the Lord. Let's share the grace in fellowship. May the grace of our Lord Jesus Christ, the love of God, and the sweet fellowship of the Holy Spirit be with us now and forevermore. Amen. Surely, goodness and mercy shall follow us all the days of our lives, and we shall dwell in the presence of the Lord forever and ever. Amen. Let's share our personalized grace. Surely, goodness and mercy shall follow me all the days of my life, and I shall dwell in the house of the Lord forever and ever. Amen. I want you to say it this way. Say, O oh Lord, I pray thee, let goodness and mercy follow me. O oh Lord, we pray thee, let goodness and mercy follow us all the days of our lives, and let us be in your presence forever and ever. Amen. Seven glorious, beautiful, and wonderful. Hallelujah. Let's go. Hallelujah. 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 God bless you all and keep shining the Lord. This is the path of righteousness, church of God. It is the church of holiness, the church of truth, church of life, and the church of salvation. We have messages, prayers. And our presence on Facebook, YouTube. Feel free to visit our social media platforms and share the good news. Jesus is Lord. God bless you. Jesus is King. God bless us to worship the King of Kings. Jesus is the everlasting God. In Jesus' name, stay blessed.